Thanks. And her name is Chloe, but give her a mountain bike and she becomes Wonder Woman. Ooh, girl with nerves to steal. I have it for you in a second. With a swoop of her cape and a grasp of her bike, she goes from little girl to Wonder Woman. Watch her hit the trails coming up at 7.30. Good morning. Like, yeah. All right, so the Avengers might be all the rage at the box office, but we found a real-life superhero living right here in the Bay Area. She is little but mighty, and you know what? She wears a cape, too. Wait till you see what she can do. We got that story when we come back. You sleep with the cape on? No, once I did. <laughs> she may look like a sweet little girl, but once that cake goes on, this Wonder Woman knows how to ride. And welcome to the 7 o'clock hour of Good Day Tampa Bay. I'm Laura Moody. And I'm Russell Rhodes. Welcome, everybody. Uh, let's start. Did you know that Wonder Woman lives right here in the Bay Area, and she has a mountain bike? Her real name is Chloe. <laughs> Chloe. And she spends her downtime taking on the terrain at the Alafia River State Park. Yeah, and one of our photojournalists, our very own Good Days, Joe Vasquez, is also a big mountain biker, and he was very impressed with this little girl's skills. He spent the day with Chloe to find out what feeds her passion. Take a look. In our darkest of times, there is an inherent potential for greatness. We need a superhero. I have found one of the most unlikely places at Alafire River State Park. Cape Coney Bee, we bought it, I say, in 2014 for a uh, superhero day at school. And it kind of just laid around the house and got a kind of toss here and there. And then we started mountain biking. And one day I said, hey, maybe we should wear a cape to school. I mean, we're doing mountain bike trails and see, see how you like it. I was kind of joking at the time, but then it just kind of took off. Other kids now, a little bit, bit older kids, they've like, they've said the same thing. They, she inspires them that now they do trails that they would never do before. They were afraid to do, and now they do them as well. And um, she's done it once, and um, she just never did the stairs. And when she saw me do it, um, she was down at the bottom, and she watched me do it. And then she tried it, and she did it perfect. She followed my line. Do you sleep with the cape on? No. Once I did. Only oh, once. Only once? Come on, I had to be more than once. Like twice. <laughs> <laughs> I've been chasing Wonder Woman, Joe Vasquez, Fox 13 News. Let's go. Come on. Joe had a lot of fun with that one, didn't he? Yeah, good for Joe. Chloe has a younger sister, too, by the way, who is also learning to ride, and yes, she wears a cape, too. Well, did you know that Wonder Woman lives right here in the Bay Area, and she has a mountain bike? And her real name is Chloe, and she spends her downtime Taking on the terrain at Alafia River State Park. One of our Good Day Flipper journalists, Joe Vasquez, is also a big mountain biker and was very impressed with the girl's skills. Yeah, he spent the day with Chloe to find out what feeds her passion. That is too cute. Just had a little winded there, didn't he? Uh, Chloe has a younger Learned sister who's also learning to ride, and yes, she also wears a cape. And I love how the cape is like her version of the princess dress. You know, yeah. like, won't take it off. She might have slept with it a time or two. We know it's more than that. <laughs> but what do they do when it's laundry day? Maybe there's another cape. Hopefully they have another Backup cape. Backup cape. Yep, there you go. All right, we got much more to come on Good Day. Let's turn over Russell Lewis in September 6th. Did you, did you know that Wonder Woman lives right here in the Bay Area? And she has a mountain bike. Her real name is Chloe, and she uh, spends her downtime taking on the terrain at the Alafia River State Park. One of our uh, photojournalists here at Good Day, Joe Vasquez, is also a big mountain biker, and he's very impressed with this little girl's skills. Yeah, so it would seem. He spent the day with Chloe. darkest of times, there is an inherent potential for greatness. We need a superhero. I have found one of the most unlikely places at Alafia River State Park. 
Cape Coney Bee, we bought it, I say, in 2014 for a uh, superhero day at school. And it kind of just laid around the house and got a cut kind of toss here and there. And then we started mountain biking. And one day I asked them, hey, maybe we should wear a cape to school. I mean, wear their mountain bike trails and see, see how they like it. I was kind of joking at the time, but then it just kind of took off. Other kids now, a little bit big older kids, they've like, they've said the same thing. They, she inspires them that now they do trails that they would never do before. They were afraid to do, and now they do them as well. And um, she's done it once, and um, she just never did the stairs. And when she saw me do it, um, she was down at the bottom, and she watched me do it. And then she tried it, and she did it perfect. She followed my line. Do you sleep with the cape on? No. Once I did. <laughs> Only oh, once. Only once? Come on, I had to be more than once. Like twice. <laughs> <laughs> I've been chasing Wonder Woman, Joe Vasquez, Fox 13 News. Let's go. Come on. Wonder Woman needs a little steam there. A little encouragement, cool. isn't it? So Chloe has a younger sister who is also learning to ride, and yes, she wears a cape too. Go girls. Hey, Dave.